Good morning guys, welcome back. Today is Monday, what is it, October 10th? Yeah, October 10th, I just came out here. It is morning time, that turkey is not supposed to be in here. I have to put it back later when we feed the animals. But, so today is, I believe 12 DPO. I'm going to be testing with another first response. I did start spotting yesterday evening. I noticed I had some spotting and cramping kind of throughout the night, at least as much as I could remember, like when I would get up to use the bathroom at night. So I feel like AF is coming, but AF is not here yet. It's just very lightly spotting still. And I have been pregnant before and had the spotting and the slight cramping. So I'm still gonna test for today, but this might might or not might not be my last test for the cycle depending on how the day progresses and how tomorrow progresses as well. So you never know what today's test will say. That is starting to go through right now. I'm going to give it three minutes, three to four minutes, and then we'll come back and check out the results. Other than that, no other symptoms, just the spotting has begun and I've had like very, very light menstrual cramping. So that could be the start of AF. Maybe AF is coming early or um, not sure what else it could be. Maybe the start of early pregnancy, but I highly doubt it at this point because it's kind of late in the game to be implanting right now. So. All in all, we're going to see the results of the test, and um, I'll share the results with you guys. Oh, and it's 13 DPO, not 12 DPO. I'm not sure. I, th I think I said it wrong in the beginning. 13 DPO. So it is the day before AF do is due, but I started spotting last night at 12 DPO in the evening time. So... It's still processing, but here's the test so far. I am not seeing any lines show up, but it hasn't been a full three minutes yet. So that's just what it's looking like right now. Give it a little bit more time and then we'll check it out for sure. All right, that should have been enough time. So let's see what the test looks like for today. Definitely not seeing any pink, and I feel like by now we should be seeing some type of pink if I was pregnant this month. It is looking negative. I'm gonna take a closer look. Yeah, this is a negative. I can still see the ev the indent line, but even that's barely noticeable compared to the last two of these that I took the past two days where I could see the indent line pretty clearly. Even today, it you could hardly even see that. So, it is negative for 13 DPO the day before AF is due. I most likely will not be testing tomorrow because I do feel like AF probably will be here by then, if not today or tonight, this evening. So um, that's probably going to be the end of this cycle. If anything were to happen and, it, and it's like 15 or 16 DPO and AF still hasn't arrived, then I'll be back for another testing. But if I don't, t if I don't post a video tomorrow or for the rest of the cycle, that means AF did indeed arrive for October. So, just so you guys know what to expect, and then we will be back eventually for the next cycle of testing in November. Or if I post any other videos, different unrelated topics until then. You can also follow our farm channel. It's called Our Vision Farm. And that is where I post 
videos about our homestead here in Florida and just different videos on there. I have a playlist called Beat Sweets Recipes where I share recipes of some of the things I make in my business like the baked goods and the jams. Then we share farm videos and gardening videos and all sorts of things if you guys want to check out that channel. If you see that I haven't posted anything on this one in a bit. So that is negative for today. Thanks for joining me back today for 13 DPO. If AF ends up not showing up at 15 or 16 DPO, I'll do another test by then. But for now, I'm just going to give it a little bit of a break because I have a feeling AF is on her way. So might as well not waste any more tests and save them for next cycle. Alright guys, this is the end of this video. I'll see you guys in the next one.